everybody, my name's Chris. Oh, it's tabbed over my journal. Duh, I'm trying to figure that out. Uh, this is Life is Strange. Welcome back. Oh, no, there's a dead lady here. Hello, dead lady. Oh, she just, just wow, she just, I'm just, I'm literally standing over her and she has no reactions. <laughs> this life is strange. We don't have to walk in the grass. Weird. Why is all this stuff like this? Hello, Evan. Evan? Evan? Speak to him. Hey, Let's see Evan. what happens. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? No, Let's see loser. You of it, Max. You have to answer a simple question. Oh, are you serious? Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Wow, what an what? <laughs> oh, it's not Robert Deserve because he created the portrait. I don't know who any of these people are, so. Gotta be Eugene Smith. Well, they both were famous war photographer images, but you should know the difference. I don't. What is it? Good who try. is it? Tell me. Wrong answer. Well, guess what? Bam! I am cool like that. What? Can I, what? I, can I just, you know. Sorry, I have up. to get back to my portfolio. No time for amateurs. What? No offense, Max. What? Hey, Evan. Let's see. Let's see if you're worth. Hey, yeah. Ah, uh, Eugene Smith, I said, right? Steve uh, McCurry this time. Steve McCurry? Unless he could travel back in time. He was born five years after the falling soldier picture. And Curry also shoots in color. In other words, no portfolio. Gosh darns it all. Alright, there you go. So it seems I have to go back a little farther. Oh my god. Then, uh, what did I ask for? Okay, this. Man. Hey, Evan. Let's see if you're worth. Yeah, I'm totally worthy because it's totally Robert Kappa, Robert the last Kappa, possible choice. <laughs> I love his work, despite the controversy hmm. about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. That's why I'm here. Oh, yeah, I'm so smart. Spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. This guy's like a honest. weird underbite. <laughs> Alright, let's read it. These this guy looks really cool at first. Now it looks really nerdy. I don't know. And Rachel Amber's face is mesmerizing. Hmm. 2012. This is, takes place in 2013, I believe, this game, so. Can I talk Hi, to you about Evan. any other things? As you can see, Rachel Amber was my favorite model here. And now she she's dead, exactly you killed her! What angles work best with my eye. What was she like? She was like Mercurial. You know what that means. Yeah. Of course I do, you snob. I, I don't. know, I can be a little diva. What do you think happened to her? Nothing good, Max. Nothing good. This guy isn't a very good actor. <laughs> the voice acting could you could use a bit of better at voice acting, sir. Uh, we need my flash drive. I think that will be in my locker. Yes. No, Miss Grant, I will not resign your freaking petition as a different name. Fountain, sit. And just sit here. No reason other than just because. This day has been so insane. In the membrane. Everything is happening too fast. Oops. I said the rewind button. It Thankfully, it didn't work. <laughs> this this power. I keep expecting oh, oh. to wake up one more time. I thought that was the girl, like in but the center shot there. Dream, that got shot. I'm not asleep. Which means somehow. I did rewind time. So there has mm. to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Alright, we should probably get my flash drive now. Oh, I'm supposed to be going to the parking lot, aren't I? I'm trying the same shot. Can I get up? Okay. We had to press the button for that to, for that to help. Go, Bigfoot! Alright, let's go back. Man, okay, is this. Is this another? What is this? I would so be there if a Sasquatch uh, actually did battle a Razorback. I don't know what a Razorback is, but I'm sure it's cool. 
All right. Oh, okay. Oops. 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 Wait. How do we? Where's my flash drive? Is that? It's. Is there like objectives or something? No. I said something about grabbing a flash drive. Where did? I, but that would be my locker if I don't have it on me, right? That's really the only other place it could be. Hello, Brooke. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? <laughs> is it illegal? Is that really yours? Is that even legal? Of sure, course. Why not? Nobody knows about it yet. Isn't it considered a weapon of war? Uh, <laughs> you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny. Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Wow, what a dinkle. Sorry, Max. I have to focus on making sure this drone doesn't crash. A squeal! A squeal! Wow, he's not afraid of people at all. I just literally stepped on that freaking furry animal. <gasps> Was that a shark eating a person? Cigarette butts. Wow. Ew, gross. At least he's <laughs> to east. Oh, that's not nice. Poor little otter. Ah, <laughs> uh, boy. Run, she has a kind of an awkward run, doesn't she? Is there anyone else I want to talk to? Should I just have a head on? Move on? Do, 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 do. Is this that nerd? No, it's not. The, I mean, the, the bully. It's not the bully. Okay. I'm clicking your name, but it's not working. Do I have to be like in front of you? Aha, I do. Yo, Justin. Check out the max. Come to Thrash? Heck yeah. Oh, yeah? Thrash Great. is dead. What's your first move gonna be? Uh. Nah. Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. <laughs> Let's make friends unofficially. <laughs> Check out the. I come to no slide. I came to no slide, but I'd love to see somebody do a tray flip. Oh, sick! You're not a poser. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nah, <laughs> I just can't skate worth shit. Oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Ah, uh, see a tree flip. Go for a tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. <laughs> he talks funny. <laughs> oh, wow. He done guffed. <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. See that photo actually matches because he was like facing completely away from that tab journal. Yeah, that pack picture does not match up exactly when we took the picture. He was completely facing away when that happened. That's funny. Talk to him? No, he's just gonna be sad. Hey, I'm stoked hey. to see those photos framed and shit. You don't really escape Betty though. Oh my god, stop talking, please. <laughs> not really. Too yeah, bad. Let's be honest. It's nice to have the females on board too. Rachel and Amber and her punk friend used to love skating with us. <gasps> the blue hair girl. Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember her name. She was hot. Tats, Tats blue hair, blue hardcore. Hair, yep. Hardcore. Yep. She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. <laughs> Ran away. <clears throat> so. You knew Rachel? She used to she has something to do with that sometimes. disappearance. One day she just vanished. Maybe she is a time traveler she's too. A dream somewhere. She got lost in the void. Anybody hurt her will get escape posse and take them out with her boards. Wow. You ever hang out with Victoria? Fuck that. I'd rather rollerblade than hang out with snobs like her. <laughs> hey, I rollerbladed once and Let's it, chill I later, fell Justin. and cut Any my leg really badly. Take some action shots. We're here for you, Max. Yay, making friends. Let's go make more friends. Hello? I think it was the last guy I could talk. Oh, there's someone on the bench over there, too. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Oh, he's foreign. Cool. Would I did you not see that coming. Letting me sketch you? Oh! <gasps> I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. Oh, I'd be honored. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse Rachel Amber. Why does everybody know her? Uh, he'd start drawing. So what happened to her? There's actually a story. The more I play she this, the more I do think class. she was also. Some people said she ran away. Some say she 
jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. I'm starting to think she actually is a time traveler because of mm -hmm. like how she's best friends with everyone. No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait, oh, she was a natural. Nope. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Oh, uh, okay. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Uh, she had a good heart. All right. I thought some drawing like start drawing. Why don't you start but. drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way. You're a good substitute, Muse. Oh, he called me beautiful. I feel so honored. Oh, Show me like all the year French girls. Question. Adorable. So quick. You shouldn't sure sketch Good. with a pen. Good. Are you saying good to my pose, or are you good to your own drawing? Because both are a little strange, to be honest, since you already said- <gasps> What?! Best portrait ever. That was quick. Good job. GG no re. He didn't even reply. Oh, no, I'm not reversing that action. That's cool, I made another friend. Got furgers. Clever. Ha <laughs> sucks with a vortex. Oh, Luke. A oh, biffle. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. All right. What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people yeah. like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. You you know him? Um. Well, he does hate I him. I busted him today with a gun. What? Seriously? I saw him wave a gun around today, and okay. I went to the Okay, well, principal. I can reverse time, so let's we'll see what see happens. We'll see what happens next. You are my new hero. Finally, karma comes to Blackwell. Ah, I'm not going to regret that at all. Oh, it didn't say that it will have consequences, though. That's like, that's like a thing that should definitely have consequences. I'm telling people that I ratted him out. The most powerful family in Blackwell, or Arcadia Bay, whatever. That cannot end well for me. Can I go this way? Can't go that way. Fine. I'm scared of crossing the street. My mom won't talk to me. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go to the parking lot. I don't know how long these episodes are, so I don't know if I'm like spending way too much time here. Because I don't want to rush through everything, alright? Oops, it's this way. And like, you know, finish the episode in 20 minutes. But if, like, this game is as late as I think Warren's it is. waiting for me and his you know. flash drive in the parking lot. So, I better oh, get back okay. to my dorm. How do you get back to your dorm? I'm sorry, I scratched my arm. Where's my dorm? How do I? Hello. I tried all the doors already, or so I thought. Are the dorms over there? Is it that building? Who is that mysterious man? Picture to my right, the right of my head. Parking swimming pool. <gasps> I want to go swimming. Person. Who's this weird guy? That's so cool that Blackwell is doing a show of Mr. Jefferson's work. I see. Move out of my way! Oh, my arm just phased right through you. Dormitories, there we go. Dormitories. Not dormitory. What the heck is wrong? I'm stupid. I'm an idiot ahead. Sure. Let's look, let's look at that. I need to go there and grab Warren's flash drive. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I'm happy it... What? Oh, there we go. I'm happy it's giving me the, uh... It's, it, like, doesn't let me go forward till I have everything. On, so I couldn't just go to, like, to the park lot and lose my chance to get the flash drive and fail that mission. Yeah. Dang, girl. I think a flash drive is something you should probably always have on you, right? I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Yes. Yes, yes. Look. Look at this I random pole. I always get a little oh, giddy when I, I think about having my own Whoa! room here. Look at all those birds! Holy crap! Some of them are just phasing in and out of existence. <laughs> oh, man. More people talk. Oh, is this that one jock guy? Yeah, there's a jock guy that I don't like. Let's talk to him. No, Be bro. Angry. You can't take a picture. You gotta bro. watch Friday's game. Yeah, bro. I hate you. You suck. Hey, this is the Native American stuff that uh, Mrs. What's Her Face was talking Warren about. Warren told me that totem is named Tobanga for a reason nobody knows. Tobanga. Oh my god. Football, Max. Big football. Step away. Big football. Hey, it's Kate. Let's look at their cycling bro. bin. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. 
There's Look at Kate, looking sadder than usual. I don't know what happened, Kate? Kate. Hey, Max. Max and Ruby. How did you Ruby like and Max I, I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there anything? Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Sweet. What's wrong? No, I want Max, to talk to you. Get a clue. Why, you butthole, you? Oops. Oh, oh no, I didn't mean. Okay. Hi, Kate. I hit... Hey, Max. Uh, you look down. You look okay, down. well, let's see if I can get her anything okay? out this, anyways. I'm kind of over humanity today. Sorry to be a drama queen. Is there anything. Max, I'd like to. Alright, well, you're gonna have more story development later on. What do you have to do with all this Samuel L. Jackson? Well, hello there. Oh my god, he is kind of weird, isn't he? What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Well, only she would know that, right? Uh, I guess. <laughs> it just makes the campus look sad. <laughs> That's a good point, but it's really worded. Oh. You knew Rachel? So even he knows you know Rachel. You just stare in awe. Nice, bro. Now I have to go paint windows. Paint windows. What do you think happened to her? <laughs> Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward. Like a clock. Sweet. Sweet. What was she like? She must have been popular. Even popular. Like cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. She was oh, like Jesus. a batteries. Positive and negative. This, this, wow. See you later, Samuel. And watch he your step around here, Max. After I sweep. I paint. Nice, yeah, this guy isn't all together. Good old Samuel. Some people are creeped out by him. And he's not creepy, just yeah. X-Files weird. See, uh, yeah, that, that was my vibe too. I forgot she said she didn't find him creepy, but I was like, yeah, he doesn't really seem creepy. He just seems a little off. He's not all there. Let's go talk to this girl. Alyssa. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Oh. Hi, Max. Hello, mate. I'm sorry. How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon I'll be <laughs> bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. Oh no, you're one I of those people. I think you're better off eating chiclet. Good point. Now, if you'll excuse me. Wow. Sorry. You want to be friends with her? I really have to find out what happened. Fine. Fine then. Let's reverse time and see what you say when I say another thing. Oh. Oh, hello. What are you reading? Love today or die forever. Don't even say anything. <laughs> it's a bestseller. What to say? Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. Alright. Okay, well, she seems kind of like an asshole, so... Oh, hey, look at that. You're guarding the door of the dormitories, aren't you? Wonderful. This is going to be wonderful. Alright. This is going to be an interesting conflict. Uh, if you guys want to see what happens... Check it out on the next episode. The Kings of the Emperor's gonna shout Ah, whoa, 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 okay. Well, they're already 18 years old, so it's not that too weird. <laughs> if you enjoyed this episode, the best way to uh, support me is by leaving a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It's definitely the best way to help me and my channel grow. Uh, we are gonna catch up a bit more here. I'll have two more journal entries, then we're gonna check out some of these other tabs. So, yeah, if you guys are interested in that, then see you in the next time. Objective, I need to go to my room and get Warren's flashlight. Oh, there are objectives here, that's good. Uh, everything feels so real right uh, right now. I can't talk to anybody about this. Well, the only person I could have, I could, I haven't seen in years, in five years. I don't know where she's at. I could confide in Warren. He's smart and knows science, so maybe he could even think of an explanation. Though I have no idea what that could be. Until I can figure this out, I better stay on this down low with my stuff and focus on my classes. Warren sent me a text asking for a flash drive back, even though I hadn't had a chance to check out all the cool shows and films on there. I watched a few episodes of Doctor Who and X-Files binge on Full Metal Alchemist. That's pretty cool. Then fast, and Faster Pussycat. Never heard of that. Kill Kill. All kinds of Amazon woman black and white badassery. I have not heard of that. Tetsuo. Yep. A total cyberpunk trip with amazing visuals. And Scott Pilgrim. For about the millionth time. Wow. Okay. I love Scott Pilgrim. I've seen that a whole bunch of times. Uh, I've never seen Do Doctor Who or X-Files. Uh, Full Metal Alchemist, I have watched a bit of it, not very much, and I have no idea what Faster Pussycat, and I don't know if Kill Kill is a different thing, or if that's just all one title, or what. On a side note, I saw a missing person poster on the campus for Rachel Amber, a, per a pretty Blackwell student who vanished. It's so sad to see her smiling face and think about all the awful things that could happen. If there was a way for me to run back six months, I totally would. 
All right, I can finally read the rest of these. Jefferson. Not only is Mark Jefferson one of the best fo photographers in the world, he's also my teacher. And one of the reasons I wanted to come to Blackwell. How often do you get uh, mentored by one of your inspirations? I've always loved his deco and golf style, and he's so versatile with all the incredible prints and advertising work. Still, Jefferson could be a bit condescending. He's pretty hip for his age, but kind of aloof and sometimes pretentious. He has this smug smile when he thinks he's real. He does not look old at all. They keep bringing up that he's old, but he looks like he's like 30. He does not look that old. But I, I do think he's preparing us for how tough it is to be a full-time artist. He acts like he understands my own work and obsession with analog images. He really wants me to enter a photo in this Everyday Heroes contest, but I've done a good job of avoiding that. The winner gets to fly to San Francisco to represent Blackwell Academy and get national exposure. I'd like to think my work could be good enough to win, and I'm honored Jefferson even bugs me about the contest. <laughs> Kingpin! I can't figure out where Principal Wells is coming from. For some reason, he seems to be suspicious of me at all times. Who knew I was that much trouble? He wanted to know why I was zoning out in the halls. I started like a fool. He has so much power over my scholarship, I get uber nervous around him. I've seen him laughing with other teachers and students, so I know he must have a problem with me. He always... He also seems a little stressed out. I would be too if I had to oversee Blackwell and all of his drama. I thought I smelled alcohol in his breath, but that could have been his clone, right? But I remember my first time meeting in his office. He was so nice and made me feel like I was becoming a part of a special role. He said I, he hoped I would become a great photographer and somebody would return the favor to Blackwell. I thought that was a bit, wish, bit wishful thinking, but it made me feel good. I just need to lay, to lay low around him until I can somehow gain his trust. You're not the boss of me! You're not the boss of me now. I've forgotten if I've ever seen Kate Marsh smile or laugh in the past months. She's really ni sweet and nice. Even though the other students make fun of her abstinence and abstinence campaign. Even if they act immature, everybody at Blackwell are seniors, not high school freshmen. Uh, she gets a lot of shit in fact. She gets a lot of shit in fact. I know she's involved in all of religious groups, but she doesn't preach to me, so I don't care. That's cool. Uh, but she's been extra quiet and introverted in this past couple of weeks. She looks like she's in zombie mode. I wish I could help her, but I can barely help myself. I wonder if all that bullying has worn her down. I could see, I could see how it would. I have to make an effort to talk to her more. Maybe invite her to a, to tea or a movie. Although she's an adult, I bet she's not allowed to watch R eight films. Wow. True love waits. Life. It's a bear. Oh no. Shoosh. I'm dreaming. <coughs> Then there's Victoria Chase, the elite of the Blackwall Academy. <laughs> Excuse me, and a total bitch. I hate saying that. I just don't know why somebody who's so rich and beautiful needs to be so fucking mean. 18 years old at a pretentious academy should be evolving to artists and scholars, not into sh reality show contestants. Victoria does everything for maximum drama. She actually wastes her time calling me out in class and taunting Kate Marsh. For reals, I wish her parents could see her in action. They cut her off that trust. They cut her off that trust fan. Then again, she's in the Vortex Club. They seem to own the school, so maybe that's why she doesn't give a shit. The odd thing is that she does know art and photography. She can't say all those French names and break my tongue. Her work is a good. Her work is a little cool, but she has a good eye. She also has an eye for Mr. Jeff Jefferson, which is so obvious that I'm embarrassed for her. Uh, she does everything but sit in his lap. He keeps his distance, so we could all tell she's trying to win the every Everyday Heroes contest. I'm sure it drives her crazy that when there's someone she can't buy or seduce. Ha! Um, I like how they did, they subtly made uh, Max be more angry towards her. By the way, they awarded this journal, because this, this journal entry has like four, three or four swears in it, and all the other journal entries, I don't know if you guys have been watching, have like had one, maybe two swears in it. So, I don't know, I like really subtle stuff in writing like that. They, they did a really good job at that. They didn't make it super obvious, but they, they kind of like, you know, made it. So it's, it's there, you just, gotta, you just gotta watch it and it's subconscious a little bit. Uh, just when I thought Victoria Chase would be the worst of my social problems, now I have to deal with Nathan Prescott. But I gotta see who's the one who triggered my crazy rewind powers by shooting the girl in the bathroom. He's 19 and already a scary fucking prick. <laughs> there you go again. More aggressive language. Um, I guess I have a little advantage on Nathan by being able to manipulate time, but if he shoots me, or I may not be able to reverse anything. Ah, good point. I have to be careful around him, especially since he's obviously got friends in high places, as his la family last name is practically branded on every building here at Blockwell. His money, his money against mine. On one hand, I do feel kind of bad for Nathan because he doesn't seem to be in control, like he's doped up or over-medicated. On the, uh, on the other, he's an asshole who nobody has called out. And he almost killed, slash did kill, a girl on campus. Should I go straight to the police? 
Police, what do I say about my rewind power? Like, like I'd say anything. I just have to watch my own back for now on, oh, school, school days. You know what? I just, I, I already thought of a solution to this. Uh, you keep stuff that you're holding when you rewind time. So what if you wrote a note, uh, or you got a policeman to write a note and then give it to her and then rewind time enough to pretty much prove that she can rewind it because she will hold the note that says exactly that she can rewind time. Yeah, look at that. Whoa, I swear <laughs> that security guard is the biggest ass here. And that's saying a lot. He always treats everyone like they're committed a crime or something. Or they're about to commit one. He grilled me in the hall today and I thought I was going he was going to arrest me. I don't know how much I I don't know much about him, but I heard he was kicked out of the army or something. Yeah, he definitely looks like he looks like porno stash from Orange is the New Black, as I mentioned before. So of course he would end up at Blackwall Academy in charge of security. Aren't you supposed to feel, I don't know, secure on campus? Bro dude swiggers everywhere with that badge and gun like he's on, he's like he's gonna tase someone. Does he have a gun? Really? On campus? That's weird. I thought he'd, like, taser makes sense, but a gun? He would make a good, uh, photo portrait of authority, though. Um, who does a guy like that marry? I feel so sorry for his family. It would be like li living the, in a barracks. Shudder, just another person I have to avoid a buckle. Collect them all! Okay, there we go. That's it. All right. Uh, next one, we will go through the rest of this stuff. There's not very much. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, I have Kate's number. That's cool. The next one, we will finally we will confront Victoria and finally find Warren and such. Uh, talk to you guys later. Thanks so much again for watching. Bye.